I gotta stop showing up unannounced, man. See, my thought process is, is like, if I text somebody or call, hey, can I come? There is an option in there that says no. Doesn't That's let true, me. Yeah. So if I don't ask and I just show up, I get what I want and I can <laughs> talk to my mom. That's one way of looking at it. <laughs> it actually sounds kind of bad. Um, but hey there, Jay's Drill Pomegranates here. Um, earlier today, my dad totally just destroyed the whole entire Juggy store. Uh, so merchandise is. I don't want to say it's halted, the production has stopped, but um, it seemed like it's going to be harder to get out shirts. If you guys can still place those orders, and uh, hopefully we can still get it out. I, I wanted to see my mom. I wanted to sincerely, like, truly apologize more because I feel responsible. Because, I mean, man, we went in there, dude. We went in and talked to my dad, and I told him. Yeah. I told him, like, that, and that just came out of nowhere. Yeah. I just thought, hey, you do something nice. And no, I, yeah, I thought it was a good idea. And, then... and he did. All right. Well, I just want to talk to my mom. But but yeah, this is this is that the night of. I, I don't know when I'm gonna upload this. I'm just kind of like frazzled. I feel I feel really weird today. But I feel weird a lot of times. As soon as I get back from fucking Juliet's house, this is a shit storm. Huh? Hey, I'm the dirt. Hey. Yes, what's up? Oh, you be rigid, nice. I get behind that. That's <laughs> awesome. Yeah, well, you know. I know you picked that up. You got it where, I say. Yeah? What are you doing? Well, I, I came to see my mom because uh, some shit, shit went down at, at the store, actually. Um, my dad showed up, completely just obliterated the whole shop. Like, he just came and he threw all the shirt presses on the ground and, and destroyed them and, like, what for? That's a good question. I don't know. I don't know. He just got into one of those moods and he was upset. I don't, he came to give my mom some flowers, but it was a whole, uh, it's like a relationship thing. I don't know, but uh, so yeah, I just wanted to, I wanted to talk to her about it. She, she upstairs? She is. I yeah. hate to hear that. I, you know, I wish things were better, yeah. but. Well, uh, hey, you got a hoodie. Yeah, things are getting better for me, but you know. Yeah. <laughs> Terry! They have Melissa here on her? Nah, she went out with my sister. Oh. They went out someplace shopping, and oh. I think Emily might even be with them. Oh, really? Yeah, they're out. Yeah, it's girl, girl things, man, shopping yeah. or whatever. Do you know what that is? Keep it rigid. What that means? Keep it rigid. That's you, man. <laughs> Just keep it rigid. Just, Just keep it rigid, man. Ma. All right, well, we're gonna go see her. See you guys. Yeah. See you. Oh, yeah, yeah, coming up. Um, I I should have texted you, but I know Aunt Melissa wasn't gonna be here. What works out? <laughs> I gotta works deal with her out. shit. <laughs> yeah, that's what you're saying. What are you, what's going on? I was just looking uh, online for presses and a new hat yeah. press. And Amazon has one, but well, I, to I told you, I, I told you, I'd buy that. You know, it's oh, very it's much, it's very much my business too with the shirt sales and things. And I thought, you know, I feel responsible for You're for what happened. No, no, I am, mom. You don't know that I talked to dad. I, I, I said this before, but I don't think it really clicked. I, I told him, I told him to come visit you at work. But it was more of like I a know, suggestive. I've heard, I've heard it was like it. a suggestive thing. Never. Like if you want to do something nice for her, do it. Go see her at work, cause like I don't know where she is. <laughs> she was alive, but yeah. But you had good intentions to tell him that, and I know. But if I, like I keep fucking up, I though. keep going over and over in my mind, and I cannot, for the life of me, remember exactly what happened. Like why? Like why? Like did what did what did I say? I mean that I right, like I don't it was know. it was my fault. You know, that's how I felt. I don't think it had um, anything to do with you. Did you did you list those those shirts? I like the diagonal one. I, I thought that was, was good. Oh, no, it's... but the Etsy store is going crazy. What do you mean? With it's orders. Of... People are ordering shit. Yeah. I don't know why. I mean, it's it's 
It's not usually usually on the weekend we get a lot of orders, but not on a Monday night. Right. What did you do? Did you do something? I mean, I mean, I put up I put up the video of Dad doing all that stuff to the shop. You know I do that, Ma. You know I do that shit. You know I upload I whatever's know, going on. Corn was filming at the time because we were doing a vlog. But you did it already. I mean, yeah, I mean just, everything's at the sh everything at the shop is in shambles. I don't, I you know, I wasn't, I wasn't expect, I, was, I didn't put that up thinking like, oh, you know, people are gonna order. I, I didn't know that was gonna happen. I figured if anything, it would let people know like this shit went down. Don't order anything. If people are ordering, I mean, that's fine. You know, we got that one press, right? That one press seemed to work kind of. Yeah, we got one press. Well, well, I, I just, just hope these people aren't expecting it before Christmas because yeah. I we I just can't do it. Yeah, I. It's gonna to be too hard. Yeah, well, I uploaded it, so. Just... Well, I just came here. I, I wanted to. Did you see him? Briefly. I mean, we we took a quick pit stop home and then we we came here because I, I wanted to. Like formally apologize because I do feel responsible for that. Did he say he, anything to you? No, he's not. He's not the one that's like making me feel responsible. This is just me feeling how I do because I told him that, and I, if I didn't tell him to go see a York and do do something nice, that would have never happened. And I mean, that's just the truth of the situation. Yeah, right? but you're not responsible. I, I mean, Jesse, logically, think about it. You you told him to do, make a nice gesture. Right. Right, I, I know, but I mean, I just. I'm gonna go up? downstairs and see what she's got in the refrigerator. Oh, like wine and stuff. I'm trying to be, I'm trying to be honest with her and put myself out there. Look, I know this shit's hard, but I mean, you don't gotta be drinking. Jesse, after after the night I've had, I am I am okay to have a drink. <gasps> Can you believe it? I mean, looks like you use condom. I'll be lucky if I can get a glass out of that. Well, I'm actually kind of glad it's like that. I mean, Ma, I mean, don't you, don't you think that's a little, like, sad? What? And to squeeze the last remnants of that bag, like, Jess, really? Yes, I want to be able to sleep just a little bit. She, she might have more. She might have more. I mean, we both know she has more. Where's she going? Ma! Uh, Did she, she go downstairs? downstairs. Yep. Yeah, she had it downstairs. Did you just help yourself to the bar? I mean, did she say she that was okay? She doesn't care. I am. As long as I leave, leave her something. Oh, she's out. She's probably having some right now. Yeah, this is ridiculous. I mean, it's not, it's not gonna fix anything. You know that, right? No, I know that, Jess. But if I want, you're gonna, I thought you're gonna. Look, let's do what you're gonna do. Okay. I guess that's maybe one of the reasons why I came here. Oh, are you listening to me or are you just looking for something to drink? I'm trying I wanna say to tell you something. What? I'm done. I'm i I'm done trying to push you guys. I'm done trying to push you you and dad together when it and when it clearly just doesn't fucking work. You know, I want to stop trying to say, Dad, do something nice, and I want to stop trying to get on your case about maybe giving him a chance, because, like, nothing's really come out of it. And the one time that I thought, you know, he was doing good, and then he just went right back to that. So I'm freaking done. I will no longer try and fight for you guys to get back together. You're going to do what you're going to do, and I just have to... Respect that and support that, and I've been trying to, and it's just been a really, it's been a really hard struggle for me. So I just wanted to relay that to you that I'm, I'm done. Well, I, I appreciate that, and I, I really do. Clearly, I don't want you to be hurt. I really don't. 
but this is probably the most important time in my life to be alone and for him to leave me alone so I can figure out you know I'm, I'm a little bit lost here you know yeah um, I gotta find myself again after how many years and, uh, and and just while I'm saying all this I you can stay here at Aunt Melissa's she's not she's not that bad of a person and I and maybe that is what you need because I know what you don't need and that's just the way dad handled things today and you don't really need me or the I camera in your face to. I know but you don't need the me that's trying to force you to do something you don't really want to do that's something I've been having to come to terms with so thank you thank you so much and you know what Aunt Melissa is not a bad person Mm. And, I, and I try to tell you before, she, she just wants what's good for me. Right. I, right. That's, yeah. I just... Yeah. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just, it's probably, you know, what's, what's for, for the best here. Well, I appreciate, I appreciate that. It's just, you know, it's taken me a while to, to understand that and just seeing what happened today, it's like... Doesn't seem like things are going to change and... You know, even Uncle Larry, you know, had that pipe and, you know, it was drama. And when you're at his house, it was like the same, you know, dad came and, you know, you've been safe here and that's, right. that's and what I matters. Just, I think I deserve to be happy. You deserve to be happy. Yeah. So this is, this is the best thing for me to do right now. Right. I mean, I don't think, I don't think the drinking is really going to be a thing, but it's like, you know. Jesse, if you want to be supportive. This isn't hurting. Okay. Okay? I'm very responsible. I go to work every single day. I deal with a lot of stuff. A glass of wine here and there isn't going to hurt me. It helps relax me. Mm. You can understand okay. that, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. I just it takes me to get over things longer. Maybe that's what I need. Maybe I, maybe I need a drink, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I don't know. What do you, would you like some water? Yeah, please, actually. There's something in there. Well, th no, this water is good. Oh. As long as she's got cups. Water. I have a refined water taste, a water palate. Sorry. Oh, you too. It's just I'm uh, sorry. I've been kind of just like an annoying ass munch. You're not, you're not, not an ass munch. It's not fun. No, it's true. I mean, I've been like. Um, it's all right. You gotta figure things out. Oh. Don't it taste all right? I wasn't planning on saying long. I just wanted to share some things with you. I'd yeah, well, I plan on just doing a few more things on the Etsy store, and then I'm going to go to bed. Honestly, though, like, don't worry about the pre presses and stuff. When I get back home, I can go online and, and order some stuff for overnight. And well, it's it holiday season, so I don't know what shipping is going to be like. But I, you know, we have to make our best effort because if orders are coming in, I got to try and. I mean, there's priority, but... Right. Well, we'll see. She must have killed that whole box. Probably. So what do you guys want to do? I don't know. Didn't really want to go back home. Corn, you want to go see Star Wars again? <laughs> Yeah, Would you be down? I'm I always down to rewatch movies. That was good. Yeah. Star Wars is really good. Maybe yeah, we'll go see that hopefully again. I'll get to see that. It's been a long time since I saw the first one. Did you want to come with us or? Not tonight. No. I'm beat. Yeah. Oh yeah, we might go. We're going to go and get out of your hair. I just, you yeah. know. Once again, I'm going to text you from now on. I'm going to let you know I'm coming. I said that before, but... 
he even told me he's probably not tonight, but I feel I, def I felt bad. I don't feel bad, Dad. Keep a rigid hoodie on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> promoting. Promoting. Yeah. Promoting? Alright, well, George, we're gonna head out. Explain it clear, Justin. Yeah. Big Ray didn't know what it was. No? We couldn't get it, man. That's a shame. He's not keeping it rigid. He's not. He's just not. He's working on it, though. He's keeping it frigid. He's keeping it frigid. <laughs> That's my man, Ray. Alright, have a good night. Let's we'll see, see you guys. Drive safe. See you, Mom. Bye. See ya. If you need me, just give me a call or something. Okay. Well, actually, don't, because I'll have my phone turned off because we'll be in the movie theater. <laughs> I just mean in the future days. All right. <laughs> See, that's a cool window. It is. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Let me check showtime. It's gotta be something, man. It's gotta be it's yeah. all over the place. Pretty oh my gosh, I imagine there people blowing up my oh, phone on Instagram goodness. for the uh, giveaway, guys. <laughs> we just got a, a couple more days left for that stream. <sighs> mm. I can't help shake the feeling of guilt. I feel like I did it. I feel like I'm the one that fucking destroyed the whole store. I think that's just me. I don't. I, don't, I think that's just me. Yeah, I don't think I, anybody else really blames you. So, but I mean, I can see why. Yeah. I think once I purchase the presses, we get back on track with the shop, and things will be better. <sighs> that's good. You know what, Aunt Melissa. Honestly, I just felt so bad, I started just saying things to my mom. I still think Aunt Melissa's a bitch, but, I mean. But what are you gonna do? I, yeah, I, I, I think, yeah, lives. yeah. But no, I, I, it's hard for me to say, but I don't, I don't think my mom and my dad are, are really meant for each other. And that, that is a really kind of uh, a troubling thought to mull over in your head is to just think that your parents aren't right for each other. And it's like, I don't know. Okay, I'm going to end the vlog now. All right, Jiggies. Don't forget to subscribe for more content. Twitter Instagram links in the description. Corden's been with me uh, all today, and uh, I really needed that. And you guys have been with me today as well. So uh, don't forget to subscribe to Corn's channel in the corner. Uh, let's go watch Star Wars again, man. I think I'll be able to enjoy it more, and I have a general idea of you know what what happens in it. All right, Jays. Love you all to death, and don't forget to keep it rigid.